Welcome to this iMindMap tutorial which will explain the use of audio notes in presentations. Firstly, open your map of choice that includes audio notes. You can tell if a branch has audio notes attached to it as it will have this little quaver icon here. If you would like to learn how to add audio notes to your maps, please take a look at our Insert in Audio Notes video. Ok, let's enter Presentation Builder. I've already gone ahead and added slides to my presentation, which you can see along here. Let's enable the use of our audio notes. Firstly, click on the settings icon here. Under audio mode, switch the option to audio notes. Now that we've done that, this icon to the right has been made available. Click this. This will bring up some extra organizational audio note functionality. Audio notes attributed to slides will appear here. Select another slide to see its audio notes. You will see on this particular slide there is more than one audio note. Here we can preview our audio note. Let's begin firstly with some exemplary authors in fiction, beginning with... We can rearrange the order of our audio notes. We can also enable and disable our audio notes here. You can use these arrows to navigate to the next and previous slides. If you would like to quickly access this menu, right-click on a slide and choose View Audio Notes. When you're happy with your customizations and are ready to present, click Begin Presentation as usual, and any audio notes will play automatically when the corresponding slides are active. Historic fiction, the category of books that are not based on any factual information. We can even choose to export our presentations with included audio notes. This is great because we can literally include all our content that we would dictate in our presentation and include it along with our slides. Perfect for archival or sharing on YouTube. Just click Export Video and enable the Include Audio checkbox. Whatever settings you use for export, including short duration for slides, your exported video will always play the full audio note or notes before transitioning to the next. I hope you found this video helpful. Stay tuned for more.